Stella, please don't make any mistakes on, on that wave bill, please. Specify the city where each of the packages are going clearly. I don't want the driver to make a mistake and heap the blame on us, please. I want my customers to get their hairs on time and without complaint. Hello, honey. How are you? No, I'm not. Oh, oh my God. I'm late already. I'm sorry. I'll, I'll go. I'll go there now. I'll go there now. Okay, okay. Bye. Sorry, I forgot to tell you, Mr. Matt is called. I'll talk to him later. Are you just telling me now? I forgot now. Hello, Mr. Martins. Hey, baby. Oh, I'm good. How are you? Okay. Um, are you home? Oh, come on, babe. We spoke about this. I need you to be at home so you can pick heavily. Yes. Oh, of course. Of course, I've eaten. All right. I love you. Bye. Bye. Heaven is missing. Uh, how, how do you mean? Huh? I, I don't know. I don't know. I, I got home and I could not find him. So I drove to his squad. They told me he left already. What do you mean by heaven is missing? You can't find...
So I've been calling. Huh? I've been calling. No, no. So you, so we have searched everywhere. We've searched everywhere in the estate. We, 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 we can't find him. I've asked people who live around there. No one seems to, 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 to know his whereabouts. So, all right, sir. All right. I'll, I'll send the information as soon as possible. I'll, I'll send it right away. Sir? All right, please, 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 sir, please. I beg you. He's our only son. Please do, do your best for us, please. Thank you. Thank you. I'll, I'll send it right away. All right, sir. All right, sir. Thank you. find him? Actually, sir, I came into the estate to buy ice bro for my business. On my way out, I saw him sleeping at your gate under the scorching sun. So I took him with me to a place where I saw pure water. And after some time, I felt the burning in back, so I brought him home. Oh, thank you very much. You did so well, thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. So I'm... Uh, oh, Please, what can I offer you? Anything soft, sir. You're fine. Yes. I'm so worried. Ah, thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. And please, what's your name? Oh, I'm Mercy. Thank you so much, Mercy. Thank you. Thank you. And where do you stay? Across Erebo Road, Erebo Road, wow, that's nice. It's nice. Um, okay. And how about your parents? Yeah. Okay, thank you. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, yeah. What? Um, I missed you. I miss you too. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're leaving mommy out too. Uh, you did not miss mommy. I miss you, oh, I miss you now. I miss you. Okay, I miss two of you. I miss you more. <laughs> okay. You don't have to. It's because you don't want to do Yes, I have business to attend to. Okay, uh... Please, uh... Just a token, a little word of saying thank you. No, I can't. Love and care is what we all should as human. So I can't accept it. Thank you. Uh, it's not like... We are giving it to you to measure for what you did for us. It's yes. just a way of saying thank you. Thank you. Please. 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 From us to, to you. To you. I'll, I'll just walk out to the gate. Okay. 
But you don't lock the gates. I will this time. Let's go. Let's go. I got a sold out carriage for you, don't worry. Let's go. Maybe what happened earlier today should be given serious attention. We cannot expose Heavenly to this kind of danger. Correct. And that is why I have been telling you we need to get a maid. We need someone who can help in running the affairs of the house and taking care of our son. Which is why you didn't come home and and then pick up heavily as we discussed earlier. Baby, please don't make this sound like I don't care about my son or my home. I do. Both of us are in this marriage together. We really need to consider each other when making decisions. Baby, talking about family, our son, our family, our home is supposed to be our utmost importance. Since the business I opened for you that has been distracting you from our family, it's not yielding anything. I, I, I suggest you quit and pay more attention to our family. After all, it's not like you're lacking anything. I should quit my business? I'm not no. saying... Baby, no, please. Don't even think about that. One day my business will stabilize. It's just a matter of time. All we need to do is get a maid, someone that can help in taking care of the of the chores, taking care of our son. Please, please, baby. Mm -hmm. You, you want us to have a housemaid? Yes. So, so much. You. What? You. What? You. What? Silas returning. I told you Silas is coming before we can deny. Huh? Is that why your face is like that? Come here. Oh. Don't worry. You'll soon see Uncle Silas, okay? Okay, Dad.
done. You look worried. What is it? I don't want to stay outside alone again when I come back. I promise you one thing. Before you, Before get, you get to the gate, I'll be right here waiting for you. Promise? Alright, Dad. Ah, I'm dead. Around here? No, really, I move around. Oh, okay. Um, can you please come to my house this evening? Yeah, there is no problem. And no, there is no problem at all. I I want us to discuss something. Yeah. Okay, no, no problem. Come. Thank you so much. Bye -bye. Thank you. Thank you. Bye bye. Bye. Thank you so much. Bye bye. Bye, she bye. Wata. Comfortable making how you made. Of course. Um, to the best of my knowledge, she she seems like a, a good girl. She said she needs some time to put things in place before she resumes, since she'll be staying with us. Okay. Oh my God, I was thinking you were about to ask another question. <laughs> Honey, please uh, don't forget to call Silas to ensure he's still coming back tomorrow, like he said. Because I'm really tired of opening the gates. I see why you're generating new muscles. <laughs> it's fine, right? It's, 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 it's 
funny to you. Stop it. Uh, cool. It's just call him, okay? Uh, don't worry, he'll be here tomorrow. <sighs> I hope someone is not about to start chanting on myself. I'm going out. I'll be back soon. Okay, do have a nice day. Shining. 
I don't. How was the trip? Why are you Thank God. I I'm sorry, he's not home currently, but we will be back shortly. I guess he's stuck in traffic. Alright, no problem. I'll be kind of Sure, sure, sure. Mercy! Ma! Please uh, get him some of us to drink. Ah, sorry, Ma. I told you earlier, Ma. There's no reason we can do that. We need to resolve what kind of house. Yes, Ma. And how much is a pack of water? I think I have one thousand two Oh, okay, but that's fine. I'll I'll just call my husband to get the box coming back. Okay. Yes, hold on, you really call my husband. Oh. Hey, babe. What's up? <laughs> yeah. support in my business things aren't going so well and I need to stock up my store I don't understand not up to a month you asked me to support you I did now you're asking for another support what do you do with the money you recover from your business because you practically don't do anything in this house. I take care of the entire family responsibilities. Lights, water, everything. Even heavenly school fees up to his school books. I get everything. The kitchen. I get all the food served down to salt. Let me ask you one question. What do you do with the money you recover from your business? Can you please stop talking like this? 
You know I love you so much and I would support you when my business stabilizes. You talk as if I don't want to help or something. Moreover, is it not your responsibility to take care of me as your wife? Demand for something you can't afford. Babe. Oh, come on. I'm not disputing that fact. I mean. It is my responsibility to take care of everything, but you know, it's only necessary that I ask what you do with the money you recover from the business. I mean, that's the idea. Now we're standing. How much is it you need? Two million naira. Don't want to give me the money, then fine. Uh, uh, uh. Fine. I'll give you the money tomorrow. You will. Yes, I will. You will. Thank you, baby. Thank you. Mm. You're the best. You're the best. You don't mean it. <laughs> I'm serious. He gave me the two million euros this morning. Wow. How did you do it? Excuse you. He's my husband, and I know how to get money from him. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I'm so happy for you. Congratulations, darling. So when is your new ride landing? Um, let's say in less than two weeks. Wow! <laughs> wow! Congrats, baby girl. Congratulations. Uh, there is a little problem here. What is it? What am I tell my husband about the car? Don't forget about it. Forget that. Trust me. I have it all figured. Yes. Trust me. You know what I can do. You know yeah. what I can yeah. do. Yeah. Yes, I am the master planner. Ah, indeed. Master planner. Indeed. You know, trust you, girl. <laughs> My daughter, you, you said you want to build a mansion for your father? Yes, Dad. Hey, God, God, thank you. 
for using my daughter to achieve my long-awaited dream. <laughs> uh -huh. You really? Yes, Dad. Come, 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 come. Hi. Sit, sit. God will bless you in Amen. the morning. Amen. We bless you in the afternoon. Amen. We bless you in the night. Amen. Hey, now tell me, what is next? I mean, when do you intend to start? As soon as possible, Dad. Just um, do your own part and the contractor will take over from the rest. Ah, in that case, there's no point waiting. Uh, just get the contractor informed and then I will show him where the land is and then work in series, isn't it? Mm, true, true. Good. That means you will go to the village with the contractor tomorrow. Uh -huh. Good. Oh, Benson. You soon become a house owner in the village. <laughs> Laura, this is incredible. <laughs> of car. This car is beginning to give me issues and I've used it for four years now. I know. Baby, I know you need a new car and actually I had plans of buying you a new car but I'm running a capital intensive business. Buying a new car is just out of the budget for me for now. I know, I know. But I honestly need it. This is really giving me troubles. Baby, I invested a lot in the business I did. I don't have physical cash. Okay, give me time. I'll get you a new car. Just patience. Um, but baby, you, you know... All I need from you right now it's patience. Please. Hard enough patience. Um, babe, look, I can you, you can borrow money and get me the car, then you just pay back later. Borrow. Borrow. There's no way I'm going to borrow to get you. Borrow! Maybe, maybe there is nothing wrong in borrowing. There's everything wrong in borrowing. Mm, there is. There is nothing wrong in borrowing. The most important thing is you're getting me the car I want and you can pay back when it's most convenient for you. Please, baby. Mm. Please, baby. I love you with my whole heart And I give you, I give you all of me I give you all of me You are my dream come true And I'll be with you Till eternity, till eternity. I love you with my whole heart, and I give you, I give you all of me. I give you all of me. You are my dream come true, and I'll be with you. Till eternity, till eternity. Wow. Wow. wow, wow. I want it, I got it. I want it, he got it. I want it, 
He got it. I got it. <laughs> Baby. Girl, this car is so beautiful. Mm-hmm. Baby, this, this, this is so beautiful. Thank you, baby. So beautiful, suitable for only queens like you. <laughs> Thank you, my king. You're the best husband in the world. And you are the best wife any man can ever wish for. Mm. Beautiful car, beautiful wife. Mm -hmm. <laughs> You're still Owen. Can you just not remind me that I am still Owen? Can we just celebrate? Huh? Sure, 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 sure. Yeah, not like the other one. <laughs> My baby. We are still owing, baby. <laughs> no, you are still owing. I'm owing, but yeah. you're driving the car. Yes. And I'm owing. Yes, baby. Okay. Mm -hmm. Hop into my car. Hop in, hop in, hop in. Hop in. Hop in, hop into my car. Who's paying? You are. And you are driving. Yes, of course. And I'm paying. Yes. Okay. Ooh. Kiria, you are the master planner. Bad door. I can what cap for you, please. Oh. See, you just, you tied up all loose ends without my husband suspecting anything. Perhaps <laughs> you do not need to thank me. What are friends for? So tell me, how is your beauty going on in the village? It's going very well. Wow. You know, my father sends me updates every day. Wow. Mm -hmm. I'm so happy for you. Thank you. So this eight, eight, mm -hmm. eight inches. This is long and here is short. No, you can just cut it. Cut I it. I love this. I love this one. You have something similar. Oh, no, you know I love long hair. <laughs> you have some you need to try a new look. No, I don't like short hairs. I love long hair. No, your money you won't spend last uh -uh. last year. So I'm gonna chop up. I have wrong with my husband. I got home and heard him screaming over the phone. The next thing, he just collapsed. Collapsed? Yes. We had to rush him to the hospital. Was he sick? No, no. He doesn't have any health challenge. Nothing like that. Do not worry. He will be fine. I promise you. Please, carry up. Pray for him, please. I don't want anything to happen to my husband, please. Don't worry. Just call me if there is any issue, okay? Okay. All right, take care of yourself, okay? Bye. Be good. He may thank you. Thank you. Thank you. What's the update? His medication. We need to get his medication. Let's go. Okay, sure. Incidents of shock could actually lead to this kind of situation. Um, he's sleepy right now and uh, we'll be able to talk in the morning. 
It will be fine. There is no need to worry. Uh, okay. Thank you so much, Doctor. You're That's welcome. Okay. You're welcome. Thanks. Let me attend to other patients. come to an end. What's the problem, please? I was stupid. I, 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 I don't understand. How? Do you remember the people I told you I was doing business with? to Mr. Billy. I never knew his account was hacked. I have been talking to a scammer. Everything I have. Everything I own. I invested in that business. Everything is gone. Oh my God. So tell me, has my life not come to an end? This will only cause you more harm than good. Please take it easy on yourself. How can I take it easy on myself? Tell me, how can I take it easy on myself? I just lost everything I have. I invested all I have in that business. I even borrowed. How could I be this stupid? How could I have done business with Billy without a concrete conversation on the phone? No. Don't blame yourself. It's not your fault. 80% of your business conversations with Mr. Billy was done through mail. He wouldn't have done business with them if his account wasn't hacked. Look, just get a grip on yourself. We will survive this. How are we going to survive this? You seem not to understand. I invested everything that I have in this business. I understand. God will make a way. Honestly, Brian, as shocking as this story is, you have to pull yourself together and think of ways to move on. You already know my situation. If not, I would have helped you. I 
I can't even think of anything. Why not communicate with Mega's company? You are the biggest customer they have. Maybe they will help you. Vegas. I think you're right. Then you have to call them. with the manager to give me at least one month. Why well, he refused. What? Well, you've been doing business with that company for years now. How can they say no to a credible customer like you? Well, they say most credible customers have been given credit. They failed to pay back at the appointed time and a new management has placed an order. No credit. do now Avoiding Dennis is not the best. Dennis and the landlady have really been patient with us. Pressure is getting out of hand. the rent and have our peace of mind. I least expected this from you. You sound as if you don't know how pretty can help. I really do. I do. But it is better we pay the rent and avoid embarrassment. You don't seem to understand. If we pay the rent now, I have nothing left. No. I don't say that. We will surely find a way by God's grace. Okay? All we need to do now is avoid incidents that will let people out there know what we are going through. First thing tomorrow. Thank you. Everything 
will be fine. Mr. Bright, your son's situation is very, very critical. And uh, it demands serious medical attention. Uh, so, 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 so oh, what, what do we do? See, we have to rush into the ICU unit due to his critical state. And you have to make a deposit of 350,000 naira so we can commence treatment immediately. Uh, Excuse me. What do we do? What, what do you mean by what do we do? Prayer, go out there and get the money. We, go out there and you need to raise the money for our son. We need... Bring your voice down. What is wrong with you? You talk as if you don't know my predicament. Prayer, don't care. I don't care where you get the money. Okay, if you borrow the money from your friend, your enemy, just get this money. We need to raise money for our son's treatment. Anything should happen to my son, I will never forgive you. Nothing will happen to our son. I'll do something. Hurry! Hurry! Um, just make sure you give him the prescription I gave to you. Okay, sir. Okay? Okay, sir. If um, after two weeks she doesn't um, respond to treatment, just let me know. Okay, sir. Let him be, okay? All right. Thanks. Okay. Uh, Lauren. Okay, yes, doctor. Your husband, is he not back yet? No, doctor. You have to call him to hurry. Oh, all right. Call him to hurry. All right. Uh, Andy, please, please. My son is in a critical condition. The doctor says if I don't raise 350,000 naira, he will die. What? Where can I get that kind of money? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know, Andy, please. Uh, just see how, see how you can raise me some money. I promise you I'll pay you back. Uh, please, Andy. Uh, the, the doctor says I don't have time. I have to bring 350,000, else my son will die. Uh, please, please. All right, it's fine. It's okay. I will send you 100,000 uh, right away. You cannot make it 200. I'll pay you back. Please, I'll pay you back. Uh, thank you. Thank you. I'll send you account number. Thank you.
Hello, madam. I beg, no vex, no vex. I don't transfer the 10 million to your account. No vex, say it take time. People, no vex. I beg, see, I, the remaining 5.2 million we will send out to your account next tomorrow. Mm, I just more delay. Eh, ah, and madam, too, please, we will see they need goods from you. Eh, me and my secretary will go, we will talk so that you go feel with them quick, quick. Ten million naira. What could such an amount of money be doing in my wife's account? Could it be someone's money? Or does the money really belong to her? You don't understand. It's all my fault. I'm a horrible mother. My son wouldn't have died. Do not blame yourself, okay? Stop crying. It's not your fault. Okay. Stop it. You're hurting yourself. Just go.
What are you doing with my handbag? Hello, my daughter. I hope you are doing well. Uh, yes, the house building is going fine too. I've been trying to get at you through the regular call, but the network is very poor. Yes, um, I still want to thank you for God using you to build this mansion for your father. Yes, some building materials have finished and uh, I took a cost of what will be needed with the contractor and the total sum is 2.4 million. Uh, please send the money as soon as possible. Thank you. Let me see if it will go. Good. Are you building a house for your father in the village? Ten million naira. I confirmed in your account. Is it yours? Answer me! Is it yours? I'm sorry, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm, I hate it. 
it from me. I'm really sorry, please. Please. Please.
Emily. My lovely son. I'm very sorry for being such a bad mother. I wish I could right my wrongs. I wish I could stand back and so time. I wish you could give me a second chance to show you true motherly love and care. But it's too late now. It's too late. It's too late because I've lost you. My most priceless jewel is God. I've lost you. I've lost my son. In the right sense, I do not have a single reason to help you out in this situation. Because what you have done is wickedness of first class order. Hell no! It still beats my imagination that you head to what led to this abnormal character, even when you knew that your son's life is at stake. Don't wreck my boat, Father. Don't. Hello? Brand. I, I have been told of everything that happened. Yes, just give me listening ears. Uh, I, I want us to see one on one. I don't think there's any need for us to talk because there's really nothing to talk about. I understand how you feel, Brian. But if this is the last respect you are going to give me now that I am alive, I will gladly oblige it. All right. All right, sir. For your sake, 12 noon at my house. Thank you. I appreciate it. Tomorrow then. Thank you. We will meet with him tomorrow. Thank you so much, Daddy. Thank you. This is the height of betrayal. I mean, Brian, if anybody tells me that Lauren can do a thing like this to you, I won't believe it. So tell me, what are your plans? There are no plans. She's been calling me, apologizing, and then the father is called to have a meeting with me. I don't want it to look like I disrespected him, so I gave him an appointment. She wants to know the truth. There is no appointment. Do I understand how you feel? Sure you do. Sure I understand how you feel, but I will advise you to think about this before taking any decision. I mean, at times in marriage, we face fiction, ups and down, but we can still caution the supposed partner, still holding on what binds us together as a couple. What are you insinuating? Go home and face what is tearing you apart.
My daughter, calm your nerves. I, I told you before. Relax. Oh, good night, Daddy. Oh, good night. He told you he would be here by 12. It is past one already. It's past one. What if he has changed his mind? <laughs> Women with their feeble thinking. Uh, perhaps he's caught up with something. I, I have a traffic. Huh? You never can tell. But I've told you before that he will come. I'm here. He will be fine. Thank you for coming. Ah, oh, Kiria, I'm so so sorry. I'm sorry I kept you waiting. Fine. Thanks. So how are you doing? I'm good. I'm good. I'm yes. So I need your help with something. I I want to surprise my husband with a gift. Well, I don't know how to present it or how to plan it. Okay. It's been over a year he opens this business for me and I really need to surprise him with a gift now that it is doing well. Wow. Congratulations, girl. Thank you. Thank mm -hmm. you. My husband never believed that I could handle this business, so I want to give him a big surprise. Is that a surprise? Of course. Oh. Mm -hmm. Sweetheart, don't do that. Don't ever do that. Yes, do not. Why? You know. <sighs> you know. That was the mistake I made. I made my marriage collapse. You, you never told me that. That is the past I hate to remember. My husband, I mean my ex-husband, opened up a business for me. When I began to make a lot of money, I told him, I decided to share some responsibility in the house. Do you know what this man did? He turned around and left all the family expenses for me to handle. Are you serious? And when I complained, he would start telling me that his business has a lot of challenges. Telling me a lot of love stories, been washing me up and down. Mm -hmm. I went ahead and made capital investments in our names. He became so lazy and left everything for me just because I was doing everything in the house. When I filed for divorce, the court ruled that all the properties in our names must be shared equally. My goodness, this is so sad. But, but what's changed him? My success brought out the Judas in him. 
chased him. You see why he hates me? Yeah. You see why I hate them so much? I, I, I understand, Kiria, but... But, you know, my husband has money. And he doesn't even care how much I earn. Or, or, or do you think my husband will, will behave the same way? My dear, can you swear with your life that your husband has never had a night with a woman before? Can you? Do not trust any man. Don't ever trust any man. Do not show him your success. Don't. Keep your success away from him. Let him take care of all his responsibility. He can actually wake up one day and walk away. And if he does, you have nothing to lose. You will have money to yourself. I am just advising you out of experience. Keep your money. Keep your money. He hardly eats or sleep. Honestly, this is the most shocking situation we've ever faced. It's a pity. All this internet fosters has really crippled a lot of businesses and lives. Do not worry. You'll be fine. You guys will survive. Okay? Okay, um, well, I'm really looking at giving him some money to start up again. What? Do not give him any money. Kira. Don't give him money. Yes. Kira, the situation at hand demands for it. Who says so? Let him face his shattered pieces. Girl, all you need to do is to support him as his wife. He's not the first person to face such challenges. Don't give him money. Do not. Let him go outside there and look for a way to sort his problems. Like I told you, he will leave all the responsibilities for you. You can see it, right? I am telling you out of experience. Yes, men are like that. Once you give them money, they will start leaving everything for you. So do not give him any money. Hello, Kiria. Kiria, my son is sick. He's critically sick. And the doctor is demanding for a deposit of 350000 before he can commence treatment. Um, I don't know. I, 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 I told him to go out and look for the money, but he's taking, he's taking time. Uh, I'm thinking of paying, paying for his treatments. For what? Your husband is dead. He's the man of the house. So he should run around to get money for his son's treatments. Okay, okay. He doesn't have the money now. Don't you? My dear, he's just whining you. Stop! Eh? Once a millionaire is always a millionaire. If he does not have the money, he should run around. Meet his friends or something. Talking about my son here. Eh? Are you sure this is the right thing to do? My dear, your husband should run around. It's his responsibility to, to, to provide the money. Okay? Just come. Stop it. Do not pay anything. Don't pay anything. He will look for the money. Your son will be fine. Okay. So this is why you let our son die. <laughs>
I lost everything that I ever have. <laughs> you did not help me. <laughs> For the sake of love. <laughs> and you turned your back against me. <laughs> understand how you feel. I do. But I don't want us to preempt issues. I just want us to rebuild it love, trust, and peace that was in existence before we lost it. Please forgive her. We can. For heavenly sake, your wife is back. Children, what has transpired so far is the reason couple are always advised not to allow third parties to come close to their marriage because third parties have caused so many damage in marriage. This marriage is between you. Whatever damage and whatever pain you have done wrong in the recent past, this is the time to make it right. For the purpose of marriage is reconciliation. To err is human. Forgiveness is divine. You must find a room for peace to reign. I love you with my whole heart And I give you, I give you all of me I give you all of me You are my dream come true And I'll be with you till eternity Till eternity I love you with my whole heart And I give you, I give you all of me I give you all of me You are my dream come true And I'll be with you till eternity Me, I want to tell you Everything I have kept a secret from you I have landed property in Inugu and Delta State. I 
also have a hostel in Delta State. Aside the hair business you established for me, I went into importation of female female wares and I opened two boutiques in the city. I have 50 million naira in my fixed deposit account. You're supposed to be keeping together. I don't know why you're doing this. I love you with my heart. I give you all of me. I don't know why you're doing this. And you're supposed to be keeping together. I don't know why you're doing this. I love you with my whole heart.
you so close to be keeping together I don't know why you're doing this I love you with my heart I give you all of me I don't know why you're doing this and you so to be keeping together I don't know why you're doing this oh please tell me if you really love and trust me can you be true please watch me share Good morning, honey. Good morning. I I hope you slept well. Yes. Take this money and the list. These are the items I want you to buy from the market. Okay, ma. Don't make any mistake. Okay, ma. ma excuse me. Ma, please, can you help me with Oga's dirty clothes? He asked me to take them to the laundry. Uh, don't worry about it, okay? Just go to the market. Okay, ma.
Welcome, honey. I hope your day went well. I, I know you must be very tired and hungry. Let me quickly fix something for you to eat while you freshen up. Sorry, hold a minute. You washed my clothes. Yes, I did. I noticed you've not been attending to your business. Is everything all right? Everything is fine. I have decided to assume my responsibility as the woman of the house and to take care of you. And I assume you placed someone in charge of your business. Isn't that risky? Not as risky as losing my husband. Um, let me... Let me get you something to eat. I love you with my whole heart And I give you, I give you all of me I give you all of me You are my dream come true And I'll be with you till eternity Till eternity Good day, ma. Good day. Welcome, ma. Thank you. How are you? I'm fine, ma. Where's your madam? Is she around? She has not been coming to the shop for days now. What happened? Is she sick? I don't think so. Why not call her? She has not been picking up my calls. It's okay. Don't worry. I will sort that out. Okay? All right. All right, ma. All right. All right. Take care of yourself. Bye. You too. Bye.
I'm the luckiest of wives because I get to call you my husband each and every day of my life. Baby, marrying you is the best thing that ever happens to me. Our anniversary may mark our special day, but you deserve to feel my love anew every moment of your life. Forever, I will love you, baby.
Thank you very much. <laughs> ah. Well, you have a surprise. Why didn't you tell me you were coming? Like to pick your calls or answer your text messages. I was thinking you are having a serious problem. Problem? Yes. No, no, I'm good. I'm fine. You are good. You are fine. If you are good, you will leave your business in the hands of your manager for the past two weeks. Uh, nothing took me out of normal. I am just paying back a bit of my family. What does that mean? What deceptive strategy has he caught you up with this time? Yeah. My husband is not a deceptive person. Oh, really? And what am I doing right now? Just like that. Wow. Mm. 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 I've come to realize that it is totally wrong to take the time with someone else's report. What are you going to do?
Bye, Dad. Don't ever allow her into the compound with me without information. Our God is indeed a miraculous God. Just the other time I called Vegas Steel Company to give me goods and credit, but they said no because I had an outstanding debt. But guess what? The new manager called me up that I can come and take any amount of goods and pay when I stabilize. <laughs> wow. Wow. This is good news. Good news indeed. <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you so much. The same steel company I called to say give me credit said no. Now they have called me to tell me that I can come and take any amount of goods and then pay when I stabilize. Wow. Wow. Indeed, our God is a great God. Cheers to that. And he never fails. <laughs> he never fails. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations. Man. Congratulations to I'm me. I'm happy for you. Ah, uh, you should be. I'm more drink. Ba. Ba, ba, man. I think we have to go to the hospital immediately. I don't have the strength to go out.
That means I have to call the doctor to come here instead. Please do. Your wife is pregnant. And this is the test result. Are you pregnant? Yes, you are. That is why I've been showing the early signs of pregnancy. She will be fine. <laughs> Don't worry. Uh, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> of course. Thank you, doctor. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Ah, thank you. I'll call you. I'll call you. I'll call you. Thank you. <laughs> oh, thank you. You should. You good? <laughs> thank you. Oh, God, this. Oh my God! Look, just yesterday. Vegas called me that they're willing to supply me goods on credit and they're willing to wait until I bounce back in business and now a baby. Are you serious? Yes, they called me yesterday that they're willing to supply me goods until I'm stable in business and I'm now. After seven years. Yes. After seven years. Ryan. I am really sorry for all the pains I caused you. I'm sorry for the trouble. It's not a time to apportion blames. It's a time to celebrate. I forgive you. For today is one of the best days of my life. This time around. We are keeping together forever. I love you. I love you more. I love you with my whole heart and I give you, I give you all of me. Give you 